Five runners in. Under starters orders and away they go. Missing the jump part was Viscount of Kilianur losing about a couple of lengths. River spray up in front by about a neck from face to fax. One and a quarter lengths away, fair print, then a head on the outside, lavish Indian and a length off Viscount of Kilianur. As they approach the first TV tower, we've got uh, River Spray striding there in front by just about half a length on the outside face the facts. And then three horses at the back, more or less in a line. That's Viscount of Kilianur, Fairprint and Lavish Indian. The five horse feel closely bunched as they pass the 800 meters. River Spray still holding the four to head by about half a length. From face the facts, Viscount of Kilianur is up on the outside, just about three quarter lengths away, and there's Lavish Indian in the center and on the rails, fair print. They pass the 600 meters, and as they take the final turn for home, enter the straight river spray there, but Lavish Indian quickly up in front on the outside. He goes well clear now. Lavish Indian quickly in front in the hands of Antia, come down from Bangalore. It is Lavish Indian going clear by about nearly two and a half to three lengths from uh, Fairprint, who is not uh, gaining any ground. And then the others all struggling at the back. There is uh, River Spray, face the facts, Viscount of Kilianur. And as they race down into the final hundred meters, Lavish Indian is really going well clear of the field. And uh, Chalky Antia easing up. His saddle has slipped very badly. And he's just about made it. It's amazing. It's amazing, one wonderful piece of riding by Jockey Antia. His saddle slipped very, very badly and he literally hung on. He nearly fell off because he could have lost the race. And he just about managed to uh, hang on to the neck of the horse.